All right, so Q&A time. I didn't actually expect to make a Q&A, but yeah, there aren't too many questions because I literally only have 500 subs. You really think people are gonna come out and actually give me questions right now, right now of all times? So I'm gonna probably do another Q&A, maybe. All right, the Discord questions first. And this one's a tough one, a tough one to start out with, holy crap. So you know what? I will come back to that one once I've decided. What's my favorite type of dog? This one. What's my favorite game? I have to say Breath of the Wild. If I'm going off of initial experience, then it's Breath of the Wild. If I'm going off of lasting experience, it's Minecraft. You know, it's either Minecraft or Breath of the Wild, right? Because Minecraft, it's like, I played that when I was really young. That was the main game I played. But Breath of the Wild, I think for an initial experience, that was the best experience I've ever had with a video game in my life between breath of the wild and minecraft as you can see i like open world games did you name your channel frog because you like frogs or because of reasons all right so story time so it's it's actually a really interesting story so no it's not i was in a group chat with uh like five of my friends right this was around the time the meme frog was really kind of at its peak it was not ever too popular but it was at its peak at this point we were sending each other frog memes right and this was during the time i was talking about making my own youtube channel so this would have been late october early november of 2019 and i was just so stuck on like i didn't know what i was gonna name my channel so i just went with that it was easy do you like how i walk i honestly i've never seen you walk do you like how i talk i don't think i've ever heard your voice um yeah i don't know how to answer that what the dog doing I don't know. I, I don't know what this dog in particular is doing. I love this dog. If you if you didn't know, it's a great. It's a great. I love this dog. Why haven't I finished Scary Bear? That's a good question. That's a great question. Um, because animation takes time, and I don't. I haven't had time recently. And by recently, I mean for the past three months. And by me saying I don't have time, I'm just saying that I just I just didn't want to work on it. Simple as that, but I'm getting back to it. So there's that. Rate my looks IRL, one to 10. I'm not gonna be harsh and say one, but I'll give myself a solid two. Is Sans real? I sure hope so. Finally, a, a legitimate question. Do you have any brothers or sisters? If so, do you get along with them? I do have a brother. He has appeared on this channel numerous times. Stop. Jokes on you. Life is a ball of <laughs> Captain <laughs> <laughs> And also in an upcoming Faz video, if that's not already out, it's probably already out. So go watch that video. It's pretty fun. Um, do I get along with them? I mean, I make videos with my brother, so I would assume so. Uh, I do have a sister. Yeah, she's fine. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. We get along fine. Obviously, we always have our sibling fights, but they're never that bad. Right, on to the, the couple YouTube questions that are on my channel. What am I studying in college? God, I hope this ain't too personal. It's not too personal. I am going to college uh, to pursue a degree in accounting. Yes, funny YouTube man working with money and numbers. Who would have thought? Stupid Nutshell has four questions for me. First one is, how in the world do you get motivation for literally anything? That's not a question I can answer, I just have it, and I, well, that's a lie. Sometimes I have it, sometimes I don't. I'll start working on a project, then I'll, s like, do it, the rest of it slow. The animation process is slow, beginning it's fast, and it just ends up being really slow. Videos, sometimes I love editing it, sometimes I hate it, sometimes I, well, most of the time I love playing the game, so at least that's a plus. Uh, what games are you interested in playing? Definitely Resident Evil Village, which you probably, by this point, you guys have probably already seen. <laughs> Definitely already seen. Portal 2, I still have to get to. Outlast 2. Uh, new FNAF game, obviously. I'm a sucker for that series. Uh, obviously. And then, Benny and the Dark Revival. I'm excited for that one, too. Why cringe? Cringe is funny. And he said the funny FNAF thing. Alright, okay, but on to Jaden. I, I realize I haven't been saying the people's names. Yeah, I'm not gonna go back and do that. Alright, my question is, what is your most favorite game you've played ever? Minecraft or Breath of the Wild, I answered that. My next question is, are you ever going to do a face reveal? You know, I'm unsure. 
I could pick up my phone and do a face reveal at any moment. I don't know. It depends on how well this channel does. Give me more subs and more likes and more views and more comments. Then maybe, you know, I'll think about it. Do you have any advice for people who want to do YouTube? One, get a good computer. It depends on what you're doing. If you're doing animation, just pick up Source or Blender and just go at it. Make sure you get editing software, all that. Post your animations. If you're doing gaming content, this is a lot more complicated. Because with animation, you can kind of just make an animation, post it. No one needs to know your voice. You don't actually need to get your, to know your audience, though it helps with that kind of stuff. Gaming is much harder um, to actually pull off successfully. Not in the sense that you won't be able to connect with your audience, you won't be able to be funny or any of that. No, it's sub count, like ratios, comments. That's really hard to get when you're a gaming YouTuber because there are so many out there, mainly Minecraft ones. And God, you know how I feel about Minecraft YouTubers. D don't mind the Minecraft in the background. That doesn't mean anything. I needed something for the background. Shut up. What I recommend is starting off with games that are really popular. Minecraft, always a good one. Play the newest games that are coming out or some of the older games that have held up over the years. You'll find an audience. Um, unless you really want to, I recommend not sticking with a singular game series. Becoming a specific YouTuber has its has really big downsides. You will get bored of a game so quickly. Fortnite, Minecraft, FNAF, you will get bored of it so quickly. It's not worth it. I, unless you're like someone like Daco who loves the series. I recommend trying different genres, you know, action, story, like s s visual novel games, horror games, strategy games. Just try a bunch of different stuff. And streaming. Streaming is really good. Yeah, honestly, on both fronts. You want to get to know your audience because the more you get to know your audience, the more they're going to watch your stuff and the more new people are going to want to watch your stuff. And developing a sense of humor is difficult, but it eventually over time, you become more comfortable with speaking over a microphone, talking to people, being funny, trying to make them laugh. Sometimes I try too hard. I'll, I'll, I'll give you that. I try too hard sometimes. Oh shit. I didn't answer the one really important question. Let me put this microphone down so I can actually spend the time to go and figure out what I'm gonna actually answer that. Now I'm actually gonna list. I don't know what music. Holy shit, that scared me. All right, so I'm gonna actually list off a couple videos. Right here, we've got, uh, we participated in the Minecraft Olympics. That's just all around a good one. Me and a couple of my brother's friends actually got together. Um, and it, honestly, I didn't plan on it. Some kind of for I was kind of forced into it. That's a good video. I I highly recommend checking that one out because that one's always fun. Phasmophobia videos I have out right now are also pretty funny. Again, me and anyone anyone that have my friends and I in them are really fun. Jackbox, GTA, Faz, Rainbow Six Siege. I made one video on that was that was so much fun. If I am being honest though, my favorite video is my best of 2020 video. The reason for that is because. It's literally just all the good parts. It's all the good parts from November 2019 all the way up to the end of December 2020. I'm very happy with how that video came out. Uh, it still holds up as I want to say the best video on my channel. So yeah, go check that one out. Not only because I'm telling you to, but because I would appreciate it. I also recommend checking out any live streams because I don't just sit there and play the video game and not talk. I talk with you people every, every time. I say a lot of weird stuff when I'm live, I'll be honest. Some of those are not my finest sentences. Favorite video, best of 2020. That's your question answered. Thanks for putting those questions in there, the few of you that did. I'll be doing another one, obviously, when I have more people who want to actually ask questions that I have nothing else to say. Just like the video, comment, subscribe, do all the funny YouTube things. Go watch the videos I told you to watch or I'm gonna break your kneecaps. Take them for myself.